12 years in New York City Transit. Story time with Slappy Avengers. There you go. One, two, three, Slappy Avengers. One, two, three, Slappy Avengers. Then I went to Express Bus in New York. Then I went to um, charter buses on the weekend with the Express. Mm. And we did charters. That's when we did Atlantic City and all of that stuff. Yeah. Then I moved down here to Atlanta and I went to MARTA. Well, when I went to MARTA, I really didn't want to drive no more because I didn't want to drive the city bus. That's why I really was trying to get out of it. But at yeah. the time, MARTA didn't have no express bus service. Like now they got that Greta and all of that stuff. But um, so anyway, I went inside to the shop because I've always been a mechanic by trade. Yeah. And so that's when I went into the maintenance and I worked in maintenance for 15, the last 15 years of MARTA, I was in maintenance. And I actually worked on the trains. Then I went into management. I was a manager for 12 years before I retired. Yeah. So then when I retired, that's when I went back to driving the bus just part time for fun, you know. For fun, right. Get that play money. Right. Get that money for whenever mama want to go somewhere or I need a new bike or I want to <laughs> come down here. Because Slappy done call me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you got that damn Harley. They got to get some Harley parts. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shucks. Well, you, uh, um, well, you done yeah. messed up now. You done daggum got on the text list. The oh, old man. slappy text list now. You know? I tell people all the time, uh, I'm, I'll invite you on a trip, and when you go, you got one shot of it. <laughs> if you if, if you damn give me a headache, you, you, you blew it. I understand. I had a buddy I call understand. me up, man, slappy, I ain't got a text from you in a while. I said, you ain't. <laughs> he said, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you got any trips planned? I said, well, you know I got trips planned all the time. I just got quiet. He said, oh, okay, you going to put a text out? I said, yeah, I'm going to put them out. Okay, yeah. okay. I I'll be waiting on them. I said, well, yeah. you know, I said, don't wait too damn long, buddy, because that last yeah. two times, your ass bad boy got on my damn nerve. That's true. You know, and, and, and here's the thing. I I'm always trying to be good to people. But you got to be better to yourself. Exactly. You, you can't make yourself miserable trying to make somebody else happy. No, you can't do it. Yeah, and I'm and I because I, you can't please everybody. You can't, man. And, and they ain't Bro. trying to they ain't trying to please you. They ain't. And it's like no matter what you do, somebody gonna be complaining about. Oh something. man, what you talking about? So, Come on. Yeah, I, I, I just I just got to the point where I just um, you know, cut the damn dick. You yep. know, I give I give you a, I give you a shot, and uh, if it works out fine, and you might get two or three shots, but that one time you act the monkey on me, that's it. That's it. That's it. I'm done. And I don't have a problem cutting it loose. No, yeah. Sometimes you got to cut a man loose. Yeah. Like oh. I said, I done raised my kids already. Yeah. I, I don't need to raise nobody else's. Oh. Uh. 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 You know. Grown folk, we should know how to get together, how to do what we need to do, and how to go on to the house. You know, and it's about when you out there on a trip. You know, people ride good, but you got to be able to be able to fellowship and get along with each other. Exactly. And and try to keep the negative down. And it ain't what you say; it's what you don't say that'll yep. help you get on the you know to get through the day. Because you can, you start saying something about everything. Don't you know? And then you know if you got three or four more, you you start that damn uh, get a shit storm started, and now everybody's uh, latch, yep. people are latch onto that complaining before they'll be they'll, they'll be like, "Don't no, stop, yep. uh, we're not gonna do that." But they, they'll they'll add on to it, and there y'all. Well, y'all, yep. all y'all complaining, y'all get together and y'all go on, and then we'll go our way. Cause I and you know them, what's crazy? Go ahead. Most of the time, the people are doing the complaining. Or the people that ain't never did nothing before. Boy. They ain't never did nothing. They ain't never been nowhere. But yeah. you complain about everything. Yeah. And they want to damn piggyback off of your damn trip you put together. You know. But, but they want to make it their own. Yeah. They want to try to, uh, you know, sabotage yours and take over and make it. Man, buddy, you ain't got to do that to me, buddy. Go, get, go on. Yeah. Go on. Go do your thing. Go do your thing. 
you know. Yeah. Lake City. I just look. I like to go enjoy something, do something. I'm open to whatever. Unless I come to you and say, hey, look, this is what I want to do and bring to you and say, let's do this. If I'm going on your trip, then I'm going to go and do your trip. Wait, you what's what's that, see, the thing about me, I dag gonna put it out there, man, be like, hey, look, this is what it is. If you know something along the way, right? You know, if you know something, cause I don't know every damn thing. Uh, when we went to Mount Rushmore the first time, uh, Bumblebee said, uh, Slappy, while we over there, can we uh, stop by uh, Crazy Horse Mountain? Right, I right, said, I saw that. I said, what's that? She so said, uh, yeah, there's a monument, an Indian monument. I said, Shh, for real? I never heard of it. So I right, them looked right. it up. I said, shit, Jay, I want to go. I, n- I had never heard of it. Right, right. So I don't know every damn thing. I put out there, this is where we're going. Now, y'all, you know, do your research and put together a plan. We're, we're getting an agenda together and uh, make it happen. Yeah, but the biggest thing is most of the time they don't even want to be bothered with all of that. No. They just want to go. And say, well, why ain't we stop here at the RV park? Yeah. Why ain't we ain't do this? Yeah. Hey, wait a minute. You didn't plan that. We didn't plan it. That's why we didn't stop there. Yeah. And you didn't say nothing. If you if you knew that was down there, you should have said something. Then we could have damn right. make accommodations if we could. You know. Yeah. Try to accommodate everybody, but you can't see every damn thing. Hell, I went to Alaska uh-huh. and back. I didn't see everything they wasn't see to get there you know you just can't see right. everything you just ain't got that kind of i ain't got that kind of time oh and like i said everybody's got their own different agenda so i mean if you got more than three or four group i mean people whether it's couples or individuals and each one of them got something else they want to do you can't plan for that now nah. you can only make one plan now if you want to spur while you're there and we can yeah let's do it and break off. I mean, here you go. Yeah. You get three or four of y'all want to go. Y'all break off and uh, go do your thing, and we'll try to rendezvous on down the road again. You know, bro, the first time, last time when we went to um, uh, uh, Biketoberfest in Daytona, I hit you up. I said, look, me and old lady going to meet you down there because when we get there, we going on down the day, you know, to West Palm with my sister. Mm-hmm. You understand? When we got down there, we hooked up. We had a good time. Hung right. Out a couple of days. Then, hey, we going on doing the rest of the thing. Right. But, you know, that's all to it. It's too easy to make it hard. Exactly. It's too easy to make it hard. Ugh. I'm about ready for a damn sandwich. Yeah, I'm thinking that, too. I'm like, you know, I could bite on something right about now. I'm telling you, tell you, pause. As the young folks say, pause. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we can find something good down here, too. Oh, we can tell the ass if we ought to be able to. Yeah. We ought to put a, a, a good piece of fish. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, some damn, uh, what they call them, damn mud bugs. Oh, damn uh, mud bugs. What they call them mud bugs? Crawdads? I call them crawdads. Yeah, crawdads. Crawdads. I used to see them miniature lobsters. Yeah, you eat them? Oh, yeah. Tan them up, bro. Come on, now. I told you, bro. My wife, she from Boston. Uh. She, she done turned me on all kind of seafood. So you eat you eat uh, crawfish? Crawfish, lobster, shrimp, uh, oysters, clams. You name it, I do it. You say bite the head and suck the tail. Or the bite tail, the tail bro. and suck the head. How does it go? Yeah, bite the tail. Eat the tail and suck the head. Oh, okay. That's why she's still with you. But you be eating that tail. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, rolling with Rush. Yeah, man. My law. Hey, y'all. It's Rono. I'm on this venture with Slappy. Daytona Beach, 2024. What? Bike week. Enjoy it. Okay! Hey, thanks for watching another episode of Slappy Adventures. Please like, share, and comment. And don't 
don't forget to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> hey, stay tuned for more videos like this.